But I must say, it's always a joy to be in this particular city, Vancouver, and this particular venue, BC Place. I'm Derek Ray, and sitting next to me with his tactics charts at the ready is Stuart Robson. And we're fully convinced this game will live up to its billing. It's Canada, and they face Al Nasser. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. And here's the starting lineup for Canada. Although we have it down as a 4 5 1, it's actually more likely to be a 4 2 3 1. They play with two holding midfield players, a number 10, and two wingers. The system has a nice balance to it. Let's have a look at the initial 11 for the visitors. Well, no surprise really, they're matching up here, but there are many different ways they can approach this game. And I just think they'll be cautious today, certainly early on. Thank you for joining us today. Enjoy the match. And so the match is underway. Abdulela Al Amri. Al Khaybari. He's failing to hit the target with his pass, and it'll be a throw in. Tejon Buchanan. Buchanan. Eustachio. Has a go! Oh, he couldn't outwit the keeper. And deciding to go short with this one. Steven Eustachio. On to David. Has a go. Now able to close down the short. Given away by Ronaldo. And scope for them to produce something exciting. Atiba Hutchinson. Well read to put an end to that attack. Ronaldo lost it. Played into the box. Oh, tremendous goal! Technical excellence to finish that one off. Wonderful to have that in your repertoire. Well, here it is again. And the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against. And then just look at the finish. That's a brilliant volley. Good technique and the perfect contact. And back underway. 1-0 it is. Martinez Luis Gustavo now with Ronaldo 
Really vital interception here. Jonathan Osorio. Ball with Alvaro. Abdullah Al Khaybari. Well, not the pass he had in mind. Luis Gustavo. Here's Ronaldo. Intelligent threaded pass here. Really vital interception. Jonathan David. Osorio has it. And unable to keep possession. Canada unable to retain possession. Luis Gustavo. Tony Scott. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal. So back underway. They've levelled it at 1-1 here. Jonathan Osorio. Well, he stopped them in their tracks. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. Davies. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Kamal Miller. Eva Hutchinson a creative look about this can he open the door to a potential goal and that was simply miles off target well I think he's right to go for power but he's made the wrong connection and it's really poor technique in the end Anderson Tariska. And he was in the right place to intercept. Buchanan. A bit wasteful from Canada. Alvaro. Abdul Rahman Harib. Luis Gustavo with it. Luis Gustavo. Gonzalo Martinez has it. Abdulela Al Amri. Anderson Talisca. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Atiba Hutchinson isn't going to end up being productive for them. The players waiting in the centre. 
showing patience as well as persistence in the build-up. And the keeper was hoping someone might get on the end of it, but it will be a throw-in. And they will make the change now. Steven Eustachio. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Cristiano Ronaldo. Kono. It needs an accurate cross. Surely, there it is. A fantastic goal. And no wonder he's off celebrating. Well, here it is again. He hits this so sweetly, doesn't he? That's a brilliant goal from a top-class player. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Well, we're inside the final 15 minutes. And attempting the through ball. And nothing comes of the attack when all is said and done. How can they find a late leveller? This could level it. And all square now. And you have to ask the question, is the time for either side to win it? Well, just look at his movement. He knows exactly how to find space. And it's also a tidy finish. That's a nice goal. Well, another equaliser. What a topsy-turvy game this has been. Eustachio uh, on the scent of a winner late in this game and didn't seem to be too much in that offside decision they will now make use of the substitutes bench Luis Gustavo Cristiano Ronaldo Luis Gustavo with it Ronaldo excellent vision oh a tremendous block well the two sides still locked together and a set piece a corner can make all the difference And over it comes. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the chance. Clear foul play, and as a result, a free kick forthcoming. And that is the whistle for the end of the 90. Nothing at all to separate these two. And now it is all about the penalty shootout. He had to score, and he does. Composure is so important under these trying circumstances. In it goes.
So lethal in front of goal. Can he keep us cool? And there it is. Perfectly executed. And the penalty converted here. And he scores. And he's beaten the keeper. Well, the Panenka has duly fooled the goalkeeper. Goalkeeper beaten from the spot. So much pressure. If he fails to score, they lose. Clinical, as always, in front of goal. And he steps up to take the shot. Well, the keeper reacted magnificently. And now a heaven-sent opportunity to win the match. And the penalty to win it! Well, what a penalty this is. He was under so much pressure, but he's finished it really well.